It's time for your student spotlight on Heart of the Rockies Radio, brought to you by Morgan Pennington of Mountain Homes Lending, LLC, your local independent mortgage broker, offering mortgage planning advice with experience and integrity. For more information, go to mountainhomeslending.com. NMLS 1856220, equal housing opportunity, regulated by the Division of Real Estate. Now, here's your student spotlight on Heart of the Rockies Radio. Welcome out to one of our student spotlights. Caleb Burgraff here with Jamie Sanchez from the Cotopaxi Pirates on the volleyball court. And Jamie, the season winding down, district tournament coming up. Are you excited for districts this year, knowing how good this team's been? Yes. What makes districts exciting to come around? Is, is, is there a different feel in the matches that you have around that time? It's exciting because you know that the regular season's coming, in, coming to an end, but you know that there's a whole another one ahead of you if you're willing to work hard and want it more than others. You guys have those those double-digit wins on the season right now. When you talk about what's gotten you those wins, where do you feel the strengths of this team are this year? Um, the strengths is having everybody being able to play every single position and knowing that everyone has each other's backs. You said you've kind of liked the middle position a little bit more. You're not necessarily tall like you normally expect a middle to be. Does that shock some people when you come out there and, and, and set up in that spot? Maybe a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> what's uh, what's the key when you're an undersized middle to, to play in that position? Um, just work on your vertical and try and get as high above the net as you can. You guys have some tough tests coming up with the district tournament, most likely coming up on Saturday, though. Uh, La Vida, Sanger de Cristo, two teams that you guys have still been trying to get over that hurdle on. What's it going to take? What's this team need to do a little bit better to get over that hurdle? Know our worth, know that we can beat them and have confidence in everybody. What have the coaches been doing to build up the confidence in you guys through the end of the year? I, I know early in the season it was a lot of just think about good things that you've done and, and, and take some time to talk about that, but has that been growing and have they been doing anything else to really show you how good you guys are? Um, they definitely encourage us and they help. They set up team bonding things that like help us get work together more and like believe in each other more. You mentioned how many weapons this team has. We'll wrap it up with this, Jamie. When you talk about how many weapons a 1A team has, how much more confidence does that give you as an individual and as one of those offensive weapons at the net when you know there's others that can pick it up if you don't have your best game? It brings confidence levels up, and you know that everybody's able to do their own part, and they have your back if you can't do yours. That chemistry is so huge. Jamie, thanks so much for the time, and good luck as you guys get ready for the, the, the rundown at the end of the season. Thank you. This has been your Student Spotlight, brought to you by Morgan Pennington of Mountain Homes Lending, LLC, your local independent mortgage broker. Be sure to check out heartoftherockiesradio.com for replays of this interview and others throughout the season.